viewers and subscribers welcome welcome back you don't know it's a boy sae big up on yourself um so coming up in today's video guys you know we're not waste no time um we're gonna zoom in and um the kind of amazon warriors will have to do without saim ayub um the pakistan international who light up cpl last year in his first season representing the kind of amazon warriors will not take part based on information coming out of the Guyana um camp from um leon johnson i think he's the manager of the kind of amazon warriors plus we're also gonna zoom in and phil simmons challenging our challenge nicholas puran to break cpl batting record this season or whatever or whenever he can but he believed that puran will break the record we saw puran break his skill record a couple nights ago which other record is he going to break leave it down below but before we fill you in on a little more details than these um topics please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell i understand so and don't forget drop a like on the video as well so Let's get the Leon Johnson one out of the way first, then we touch on Phil Simmons. You understand? You know, um was browsing through the media. Um from last night I see this I saw this, this article, you know, people, but you know, I just really got the time to really um bring the cars to you guys and feed you in on the details. But um let's see. Um from West Indies test battle, Leon Johnson confirmed to Ghana Chronicles. Um, that Pakistan opener Saim Ayub, who is presently playing against Bangladesh in a two-test series, will not be available for the 2024 CPL. Right, last year the 22-year-old finished the CPL as the second-highest-run scorer, with 478 runs in 13 innings at an average of 43.45 and a strike rate of 142.26. Right. Only his Guyana um, Amazon Warriors teammate, Shea Hope, was ahead of him with 481 runs at 53.44 and a strike rate of 140.23. Ayub is involved in um, the test series against Bangladesh, making 56 and 1 in the first test, which Bangladesh won by 10 wickets. You know, um, so that's a little news people coming out of the Guyana camp, you know, so basically um the 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 the, the, the Guyana Amazon warriors will have to do without um same are you but you know it's a big blow to them people so you know what i mean they have to go start looking for open and now we saw kevin sinclair is there on the bench guys they said he can open the button i did look research on him they said he can open the button um because we actually multi won't cut it as opening button and we can promote she more she, she hope can come up and open the button as well but i think they want to stick with she up at that number three position but you know other players in the team and have to step up you know so let's move along to the other topic so you shouldn't you shouldn't have any problem passing it. TKR coach Phil Simmons challenges Puran to break CPL batting record. So breaking universe boss um, Chris Gale, nine-year-old record. Compatriot Nicholas Puran put up a big hitting clinic and route getting to 139 T26s in 2024, the most by any batter in the a calendar year. We already give you little, little news on that in the previous videos, and one, but um, I told you all of to you here that um, Trinbago Knight Riders head coach Phil Simmons has challenged top order batsman Nicholas Puran to surpass the Republic Bank Caribbean Premier League CPL T20 record for most runs in a season at the 2024 edition. So, earlier I mentioned whenever about his been specific he wanted he want Puran to break it this season people you know and really set a record you know and being the one to break the CPL batting record and be the leader you understand as we know Johnson Charles is leading I think nearly 3,000 runs he's near 3,000 runs guys followed by I think Glendale Simmons Chris Gale etc um so Puran has an uphill task so this man you're expecting this man to score nearly a thousand runs in this year's um cpl well we're gonna see if Puran can do it because it's gonna take some batting you yeah, understand to really do that he has 2000 had cpl runs already so um it's gonna take some really good batting people for him to get each match is in the different was much man 13 and then so much much you have to play 13 depends on the, if you go to the final so each match you want a man to score nearly 100 and 
hundred nine in the nineties because if a man nine he already scored ninety seven in the first match. So he can get it guys if 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 if, if this man's believe in him. We should believe in him as well. But um it's gonna be hard to really break that record, you know, because not every time a batting gonna come and click. You understand? So you're gonna get toes and hard runs to really surpass everybody, but Let's continue. Simmons made the call during TKR's victory post match meeting on August 31st after thumping St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots by 44 runs in their opening match at Warner Park in Basarat or um, St. Kitts. Right? His early dominance with the bat spur Simmons and to challenge the left hander to achieve a record breaking 2024 season. New Zealand, the Colin Monroe leads the most runs in a season category. Um, Curtis is still a 567 runs achieved for TKR in 2018 edition. So, um, so he's not saying break the CPL record. He's saying break a CPL record, yes, but break the most runs per season. Because if you have a man, it's going to be difficult for him to break the all-time CPL record as a leading run scorer. So, um right in this season because i believe in the future he will lead you understand but for now 567 you need 568 runs guys in this season to break it last year we saw she over 400 and had runs you understand so it's not impossible and the farm that nicholas puran is showing now people is something that you guys should look and take notice of because it's it's, it's something that the west indies seen a couple years ago ago from chris gale and now we are seeing it from nicholas puran so you know his success up Gale's successor, but let's continue. Poor and most successful CPL season with the bat came in 2023, where he scored 291 runs in total, right? His stellar knock of 97 was made up of 960s and 74s, which he struck with when he struck um his six um six um poor and became the batter to achieve the most T26s in a calendar year after he surpassed Chris Gale 135. So Puran now lead the global standing with 139 T26s in a calendar year and and the tournament has just begun. So you know he will may he might go up to if the time the year done, people, he might reach that 206 or, or 220. You know, because we have a couple of series remaining and we have a couple match good amount of match 13 match or so, 12, 13. Uh, matching the CPS, so you know you're gonna up there, you understand? So, wish him luck. But speaking to Puran during their dressing room team meeting, Simon said, First, I think you have shown the level you are on right now, and my challenge to you is how far you can put this CPL run record for a season. The kind of farm you are in, you shouldn't have any problem passing it, but it's how far you can take it. Puran congratulated his fellow batsmen for. A tremendous um, opening effort and Narin also lauded TKR's bowling attack for a job well done. Narin said, I think that it was a good effort, you know, and especially not giving away runs but picking up those two early wickets in that lineup was very critical or crucial. It was a good first game. We set the tone and know what we have to do from now on. From now going forward, all the best. To the bowlers and continue the good work as we know as soon as get them after a really good start so coach simons believed tkr got the outcome they wanted and wants to maintain their winning ways as the tournament progresses and what he said um it's the first game right in a long tournament and yes we have to enjoy every win that we have we got to make sure and understand there is a lot of cricket to play and we cannot drop the standard we have to we have set today we didn't set the best standard the level the levels that everyone can achieve in our feeling but in our batting and in our thinking and bowling we have set our standards so let's make sure that we can go hard to keep that standard as we go along so people that was what um phil simon's nicholas um sunal narin etc and also slime and you would not take part in this year's cpl but leave your thoughts down below big up on yourself all right